first one here is a uh, custom made this is the classic chompin t-rex but it's custom painted to look like the diablo t-rex so this one is really awesome looking i call him the zombie rex and the next one here this is from the quest for the indominus rex pack uh these guys the ones i'm showing you guys here most of these i have reviewed and done battles of so today we're just going to look at them uh really quickly this is the skeleton of the indominus rex and it is uh perfectly sized and detailed it is awesome and then we have the coolest jurassic world fallen kingdom toy you are ever going to get this is Alpha Training Blue. You can't even get this one yet. Uh, very soon you'll be able to get it. I did a full review of this guy and he is totally awesome. So I dress up as Owen and train this guy because you actually have to train him. So he is one really cool dino and he likes to get pet. So check out that video. And then I got another Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom Legacy Collection. This one is the Chompin Spinosaurus. I had to actually buy this one from uh, Great Britain because they don't sell him in the US. And he is awesome. His mouth's open because I jammed the Lego in there. But uh, that's the only way you could get him to totally keep his mouth open. And then another really cool one. Uh, I have not reviewed this one yet. I will be doing a review of this one uh, probably the end of this week. This is the the uh, Anatomy T-Rex. So it looks exactly like the T-Rex, but you could take it apart, see inside, take out the muscles and the bones and stuff. It is awesome. And then we have the Roaring Sinoceratops. Really cool herbivore. And then we have another awesome Pteranodon. This is from the Destructosaurus helicopter set. This one is the biggest Pteranodon I've seen and he is awesome. And then we have the orange head Baryonyx with chomping action. This came with the uh, Lava Surge uh, set, which is a slime set. It's really cool. Check that one out. I slime a bunch of dinos. And then we have the Minmi, which is another cool herbivore. And then the Protoceratops, another really cool herbivore. And then the Proceratosaurus. Oh, so this guy almost looks like some type of a miniature Velociraptor without the third claw. And then we have four hatching dino eggs. Go ahead and push that down and the dinos pop up. Ah, so this one is Velociraptor Blue. So it is a baby blue. And then we have a cute baby Triceratops. We have a baby Stigmalock with growing spikes. And then a cute baby T Rex that turns into an evil Rex. Check out those teeth. <laughs> the teeth grow when you turn this dial. <laughs> awesome. So this huge guy here 
is a uh, battle damage colossal roaring t-rex that was custom colored and custom teeth let's check this guy out so he does roar custom teeth in it all of these i do have full reviews and battles of guys so check out my playlist at the end of this video and then i got some big ones i couldn't even fit into the box this is the original colossal t-rex so no sound but he will swallow a bunch of action figures which you could take out of his stomach and this next one is the original uh battle damage roaring colossal t-rex which was sold at walmart so this is the one you've seen the very first one but customized so he does make sound he's got all the battle damage on him all over really cool dino and then another really cool one probably my coolest one this is a custom Jurassic World thrash and throw T-Rex so this is the one that's got the movement on the tail you could thrash it back and forth their roars it stomps but this one is custom made custom colored and it has custom teeth made for it really cool and then this one here is just like the one you seen uh, the one you just seen was this guy customized so this is the thrash and throw t-rex with all the controls through the tail the stomping action really cool looking dino and this one here is the legacy edition uh chomping t-rex big huge tongue sticking out i mean he looks like one of the singers from the band kiss and then this one is the same dino but uh, exclusive to walmart with the battle damage so basically just damage painted on now one of the coolest ones i got this is a new one i just got this is the uh, grab and growl in the raptor so it's got full movement through the head uh puppeteer type movement it does also grab with its arms when you turn the dial and it has sound and the eyes light up here so this is a really cool looking Indoraptor. And then down here is the original Indoraptor. So they do look pretty identical, but this doesn't light up, doesn't make sound. This is just almost like a generic version of the one I just showed you. And then down here we have a Spinosaurus look-alike from the Spinosaurus family. This is the Sukumimus. This one doesn't have sound, but if you push the button here, it does open and chomp its mouth. This is an awesome looking dino. Like I said, full reviews and battles of all of these. Check out the playlist at the end of the channel. And then we have a uh, big huge Stegosaurus. So this guy's action feature is he swings his tail back and forth when you push the spike on his back here. Really cool looking huge Stegosaurus. And then back here we have a huge Pteranodon. Check this guy out. This is the biggest Pteranodon I've seen and the most uh, accurate looking for like movement and flying. And then over here we have a giant size Velociraptor Blue. So uh, you'll see when I get to the other. The other raptors are about the size of the Stiggy. So this blue is way bigger. I believe it's a 12 inch figure from head to tail. And then here is a cool one I found at Target. This one, oh, I think I turned it off. This one does make 
awesome. So different dinos you uh, plays games and stuff, and it comes with two walkie-talkies. And then I've got some movie theater exclusives. These were uh, in different countries. Uh, you could buy these. This is the Indoraptor head. Pops open. You could fill it full of popcorn. And the same with this T-Rex. The head pops open. You could fill it full of popcorn. These ones I bought from uh, Mexico. And then they also had this huge Jurassic World uh, egg here, which I believe in Mexico this was used for popcorn or ice cream. So you could have put ice cream in there. It just says it says Jurassic World Solo and Sinez. And then also with that too, I bought this giant gyrosphere that you fill up with popcorn and you could eat it right out of there. So cool. And some other really cool ones is I have an Indoraptor mask here. You put the straps on and when you talk, the mask opens and closes as your mouth does. And the same with the T-Rex. You put the mask on and when you talk, it chomps. And then the coolest mask of all is this Velociraptor blue one. Because as you open the mouth, it makes sound and the eyes move. It's like a glass eye. I mean, it's very realistic looking. This is a cool looking mask. And then we have a gyrosphere launcher vehicle by Matchbox. If you push this, it launches the gyrosphere right out the front of the truck. You could put characters in here. It's a really cool looking vehicle. And then over here, I have a remote control gyrosphere. Oh, this remote is right here. So this one, it does move forward and it spins. Really cool. We have uh, another gyrosphere. This is from the Gyrosphere and Claire story set with like a broken top. And we have the sub from the movie that uh, goes down, finds the Indominus Rex's body in the bottom of the sea. And I believe this, the Mosasaurus also does end up attacking this one. And then over here, I have a uh, Raptor Attack remote control here. Uh, I don't think. I think I might have turned it off. So this one does drive. The seat pops open. It throws Owen out. When the Raptor uh, springs forward, it hits a spot here. The seat pops out and it looks like the Raptor actually got Owen right out of the Jeep. And then I have a Legacy Edition uh, Jeep Wrangler from Jurassic Park. This one is sold at Target with a uh, working winch. I've got a big like dyno transport truck here with sound, working lights, opening doors. You could put characters inside. You could put the dinos in the back, even the bigger dinos like the Sukamamis will fit right in there. So this was, I believe, made by Matchbox. And then we have this big, huge, real feel Mosasaurus. So this guy is a huge rubber dinosaur. You could actually take this Kids could play with this one in the bathtub. It's really cool. And to go with the Velociraptor blue mask I showed you earlier, you got some awesome rubber Velociraptor blue claws. And then here is uh, one of the Aurorivore Ceratosaurus. And then I have a nice big Carnotaurus with 
chomping mouth. I actually gave this one away in a giveaway, a brand new one. So keep watching for giveaways. And then over here I have a Jurassic Park a remote control Jeep with mud splattered all over it. And a big huge Imaginex Indoraptor. So this guy actually, uh, it comes with like a Jeep and this guy will chase the Jeep. Let me see, I believe I could show you the running action if I turn this, there we go. So it looks almost like he's riding a bicycle. It is hilarious. And then we have a uh, big huge Ankylosaurus with swinging club tail. We have a uh, Metricanthosaurus chomping action and sound. We have a uh, chomp chomping Allosaurus with chomping action and sound. We have an awesome Jurassic World Matchbox portable set. And we have some little ones. This is uh, one of the attack packs Dimor put on. And then we have uh, Battle Damage Stiggy Malak. You can see this guy's, eh, he's a little shiny. I had, I put this guy into a slime pool. So, eh, I hope it actually washes off. <laughs> okay, here we have a really cool Velociraptor blue and a red Velociraptor, which is, uh, it's an exclusive pack that is sold at Kohl's stores only. And then we have a Pachycephalosaurus with a head springing action there. Back here we have an awesome Triceratops. Moves his head and makes sound. Wow, we have a lot of dinos from Jurassic uh, World Fallen Kingdom. Here we have a Velociraptor Blue with springing action. Here we have a cool Dilophosaurus. Its frills pop out over there. And then we have a lot of Gallimimuses. We have an orange Gallimimus. Uh, we'll get to the other ones in a moment. A gray Gallimimus. We have a green Velociraptor. We have a baby. T-Rex. We have another brown Velociraptor with the springing action. I believe this is one of the Legacy Edition ones. This is another Legacy Edition one with springing action. And then we have a Battle Damage Monolophosaurus. We have another awesome Velociraptor Blue. Here we have a uh, classic edition, uh, one of the legacy edition Pteranodons. And here we have a uh, battle damage Triceratops, but they actually put the horns on backwards. <laughs> that is really weird. Here we have the Velociraptor. This is the one that actually uh, goes on that attack uh, rank Jeep Wrangler. This one, the one that swings forward and attacks Owen. Uh, let me see, we have an Owen on a motorcycle here. This is like the rip and roar motorcycle. We have some Funko ones. This is a Funko T-Rex. This is a Funko Ion Malcolm. We have a Funko Dr. Grant. Over here we have uh, Funko, Funko Dennis Nedry, uh, Funko John Hammond. We have a uh, Brown Gallimimus, a uh, Battle Damage. We have a uh, Baryonyx with Chomping and Sound. 
And then we have another gyrosphere. So uh, a lot of the set, there's three or four gyrospheres you could get in the set. So uh, we have uh, battle damage, Herrerasaurus. This guy, if you hit him, he opens up, chomping, cool. And then we have uh, awesome, like rip and roar, Velociraptor Blue. He attaches to Owen's motorcycle. And we have a uh, green Dilophosaurus with pop out frills. We have a uh, awesome Dimorphodon here. And then moving on, we have this is the four wheeler that goes to the uh, Indoraptor set. This is the one Owen rides and the Indoraptor chases. And we have a uh, Funko Dilophosaurus. We have a uh, green Gallimimus. Over here we have a uh, crushed T Rex mask. We have a uh, like greenish blue Velociraptor with the springing action. Over here we have these ones are really cool. These are the. Uh, Takara Tomi original licensed products. So this is these are from Fallen Kingdom, the Fallen Kingdom T-Rex, Indoraptor, Stiggy Moloch, Mosasaurus, Velociraptor Blue, and Carnotaurus. And then so far I have a bunch of the action figures here. I'm just gonna Pull these out really quick so we could see the different action figures because there is quite a few of them. So that that's one thing that's awesome. They brought back. The action figures. The other, uh, the first Jurassic World set, they had one action figure, which was Owen with a Velociraptor blue set. So this one not only brings uh, the Jurassic World characters, they bring back a lot of the classic characters from Jurassic Park. So it'd be the Jurassic World Legacy Edition. And then I have a box huge bag full of Jurassic World miniatures. These are from 15 packs from Walmart Battle Damage and but most of these are from blind bags. I have three of the Jurassic World dinosaur skeleton sets. You have the Triceratops, the Velociraptor, and the Stiggy Malak. And a bag full of Matchbox cars from the Fallen Kingdom movie. And a bag full of Imaginex dinosaurs and characters. Wow, that was a lot. Oops, I almost forgot. One more, like almost light orange brown color. Gallum, I miss. That's a lot of dinos, and they still are coming out with more, so keep watching to see even more. Okay, uh, I almost forgot, I also do have all of the Jurassic World Lego sets, which I've put together in stop motion animation. Those are cool. Uh, I believe there was 14 of the Lego Fallen Kingdom sets. The dinos are the Carnotaurus, a brand new T-Rex mold. The original T-Rex mold, the Indoraptor, and a sea rest of these. We have a classic Velociraptor, a classic Dilophosaurus, we have the Stiggy Malak, we have two of the Velociraptor Blues, a green classic Velociraptor, and a Pteranodon. So those are the Lego ones. And then my final one is the remote control Pteranodon. 
Okay, so the first one we're gonna pull off is the Abominable Snowman, or the Yeti. Uh, by the way, guys, I do have full reviews of all of these and unboxings and awesome battles. So go ahead and check out my Animal Planet playlist at the end of this video. Then our next one is the crocodile. Cool. And most of these do have action features. And we have uh, Leah Plaridon. A tiger shark. Giant octopus. Whoa, this guy is cool. Some of his uh, tentacles can move in different directions. An awesome Spinosaurus. I just did a full review and a really funny battle with this guy. You guys gotta check that out. A giant evil tree. Really awesome T-Rex. This guy has a switch down here. If you push it, he like moves his head forward and his eyes light up and he roars. Really cool.
And then we have a cool remote control T-Rex. Eyes light up, he moves his head. His head is rubber, so when he moves it looks realistic. Uh, he does roll on these rollers when you use the remote control. Awesome jungle elephant with a stand here for the action figures to ride. His head moves up and down, big huge tusks in the front. It says Animal Planet here, really cool. Double-headed cobra snake. So if you push his tail, his head strikes. At least one of his heads. The other one you have to control yourself. So this one is a really fun toy too. Got a uh, deep sea submarine. I did a full review on this one, and it is a cool toy. It does all kinds of cool sounds and lights. Planet Sucomimus. Orange and blue, really ferocious looking. Animal Planet Dimetrodon with action feature. Really cool big sail back here. Planet Spinosaurus with action feature. You pull his arms, he will chomp his mouth, his sail lights up, his eyes light up, and he roars. An 
Animal Planet Armored Triceratops. Unfortunately, he does not have any action features, but he looks really cool. Planet, great white shark with action feature. You push his fin, he opens and closes his mouth. He's really ferocious looking. Chest pounding King Kong. Okay, this is not Animal Planet, but it was in the box, so I thought I'd show you guys. And he roars also. Big Animal Planet T-Rex that came with one of the huge sets. Unfortunately, this guy doesn't do anything and he is hollow and really cheap looking. So, uh, next to a lot of the Animal Planet ones, this one's kind of disappointing. Giant Animal Planet Spider. You roll this guy and his legs move back and forth and he looks like an actual huge spider. Oh man. Animal Planet Elasmosaurus with action feature. You push this button, this guy strikes. Ah, hey, yeah, hey, hey. <laughs> really cool. Animal Planet Orca or Killer Whale. Pull his fin and he opens and closes his mouth.
Animal Planet, Carnotaurus with action feature. This guy roars, he opens and closes his mouth, and he is really evil looking. Animal Planet Velociraptor with action feature. Move his arms, he roars, and he opens and closes his mouth, and this thing here lights up on his head. And then we have a lights and sounds Dibrachosaurus. This is not an animal planet. This was actually uh, from China, but it is really cool. You turn it on. This guy lights up all over here. He moves his leg. Uh, he made a really annoying sound, but I found a way to kill the sound because it just drove you crazy. But he is really cool, flashy dinosaur. Okay, and then I have a light and sound Spinosaurus. This also is not Animal Planet, but it is a set I bought from China. So this guy moves his arms and legs, his lights flash, his spine over here actually lights up, so that is really cool. And then an evil Bigfoot set. So if you squeeze this guy's arms, he's like, Ah! Woe is me! Whoa, whoa! Doom! 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 Uh, instead of throwing his arms up, he probably should swing the club down, but... Two animal planet scorpions. So these guys could have a scorpion battle. By the way, guys, these animal planet sets are awesome. They are huge. Uh, if you want something that is complete and affordable, definitely uh, look up some of these. I'll put a link below uh, where you can buy a lot of these sets.
and a white animal planet velociraptor. Another cool animal planet, T-Rex. You move this guy's arms, he opens and closes his mouth, and he's very colorful. This guy is awesome. Animal Planet Anglerfish. This is the one that you would see in uh, Finding Nemo. So this is the one that has the light here that will light up. But when you get close, chop! And then we got some cool like miscellaneous animal planet ones. So let's take a quick look at some of these. Like I said, the animal planet sets are really like cool that they have a lot. They include pretty much everything you need. This is uh, actually an Adventure Wheels T-Rex here. And this is another colorful T-Rex with uh, no action feature. And then, I uh, did buy a safari set, so you've got a lioness and a lion. So here, the male lion and the female lion. So this one is a little bit hard to push, and all it does is move its legs a little bit. And then some smaller dinos, a small anglefish here, a little, Tiger shark here, uh, Dilophosaurus over here, uh, Pachycephalosaurus here, this one. And then uh, a lot of action figures. Uh, if you want to see these action figures in actual action, uh, go ahead and go to the end of this video. There's an Animal Planet uh, playlist. I mean, there is a lot. Each one of these big sets usually comes with about three action figures. So there is a lot of them. So go ahead and check those out. And we've got a dodo bird here. A cheetah. Uh, another little Spinosaurus. Awesome. Want to see more dino videos? Click the subscribe button now.